This is the third program in the HDEP process, a series about managing hazardous materials incidents, and it's called Hazard and Risk Evaluation. Let's start by getting an understanding of hazard and risk assessment. Hazards are generally the physical and chemical properties of a material that can cause harm. It could be, for example, a material's flashpoint or level of toxicity. Hazards are real. In contrast, risk is the probability of suffering a harm or a loss. Risks are different at every incident and can even change throughout the incident. Risk must be evaluated by a knowledgeable incident commander. The objective is to minimize the level of risk to emergency response personnel, the community, and the environment. Factors that influence the level of risk include the hazards of the material, the quantity of the material involved, the containment system, the type of stress applied to the container, the proximity of exposures, and the level of available response resources, including the level of training and the experience of the responders. <laughs> 